In this video, I will show how to find duplicate records in tables using SQL. So for that we will be using the employee table. So before starting the query, we have multiple methods to find duplicate records using SQL. But this is one of the simplest method to find duplicate records in SQL. Uh, here we will be using count and having clause in SQL to find the duplicate record. So first of all let me query the table to see the schema and the data. Let me run the query. Yeah, this is one of the table which I'm very commonly using because the table is very simple and it makes the entire scenario easy to understand. So we have employee ID, employee name, department name and salary column. Then uh, one thing to notice here is that currently the employee ID is, a, is the primary key and so basically the primary key won't be repeating. Primary key will be unique for a single row. Now we want to check if the table is having some duplicate records. Let me route the query for the same. Select employee ID, comma count star from employee I have to put a group by clause because count is an aggregating function I have to put group by and grouping by employee ID then after that I will be using the having clause having count of star greater than 1 so this having count greater than 1 means that uh, whenever there is a row with employee ID and count where count is greater than 1 that time the row will get displayed all other time the row won't be displayed such that when the count is 1 the row won't get displayed now let us run the query and see if we have any duplicate records in the employee table see now we can see that we don't have any duplicate records in the table one more thing here you can see that no column name because I haven't given any column name to count star here uh, I have to if I have to give a column name I can use the us and give an alias column name which is id count sorry I have to use underscore here now once again I am going to run the query Oh, sorry. Mm. Yeah, now it will be correct. See, so now it's employee ID and ID count. We don't have any duplicate records. Now I'm going to modify this table a little bit. What I'm going to do is I'm going to enter one more row where the employee ID is 101, employee name is Mohan, admin department is admin, and salary is 4000 let me enter duplicate record insert into what is the table name employee and the column names are employee id employee name department name salary and the values are 101 name is Mohan sorry I don't have to use single quotes here because this is a number Mohan then department is admin comma and the salary is 4000 now let me run this query and insert this record into the table 
yeah now we are getting an error here because this is the violation of primary key constraint because when i created this table i have created the table as uh, i have given that constraint for that specific column as a primary key the, so i can't insert the same record into the table what i will do is instead of uh, 101 i'm going to give some 1020 mohan admin let the all other records remain same and instead of this employee id i will be using the employee name and see if we have any duplicate records let me run this theory again we are getting because i think 120 is also used let me see oh, what value i can use i'm going to use 125 because till 124 we have used 125 will use yeah one row is affected which means the table has got updated with the new row 125 yeah as you can see 125 the table got updated now once again i'm going to rewrite this theory in the basis of employee name so instead of this employee id i'm going to rename this as employee name instead of id count i'm going to give us name count group by also i'm going to change as name count remains the same because now what now what we are going to do is now we are counting the uh, counting how many times the names are getting repeated which means we are taking the employee names and counting how many times the employee names are coming and uh, whenever the employee names are appearing more than once only then the data will get displayed which means we are having some duplicate record so this query is to find the duplicate names from the table now let me run this query see the result is employee name mohan is repeating two times because the name count is coming two times now let me remove this having clause and show you what will happen now if i run this query what happen is every employee name will come with the count one if i scroll down you can see mohan in between where the name count is two see if i i can sort this also using the order by clause order by count i can uh, sort this by the count instead of count star i can use this name count uh, name count as, uh, as well now let me execute this query and put desc because i have to sort this in descending order the count which is highest should come up the top now you can see mohan has got the name repeating two times and all others are all other names are coming only one time only that is why when we give the condition using having clause having count of star greater than one we are only getting the name which is getting duplicated that is mohan which is coming two times so this is how we uh, find duplicates in tables using sql this is a simple method thank you